the subway will take you anywhere in the city, even to ancient Egypt, thanks to the museum. This looks great. It looks exactly like the real thing. See? Oh, that? It's a hawk. It warns people that this is the pharaoh's barge. Ah, my history teacher is going to love it. At least I hope she'll love it. I really need an A. <laughs> There's only one thing left to do. <laughs> see if it floats. Oh, man, this is great. I can see if my boat holds up in bad weather. She takes a dripping and keeps on, uh, floating. Yeah. My history teacher's gonna be so impressed. I mean, I actually did my homework. I need an A to pass the class. George was sure Steve would get an A. His homework floated really well. Unfortunately, it was floating away. Kid, you can't go down there. Oh. Uh, you don't understand. My history homework is in there, and I've just got to get it back. I've just got to. Uh, otherwise, I'll be stuck in class with my kid's sister next year. That's rough. Yeah, you're telling me. Hold on. What? Ah. Anything that goes down a drain goes to the wastewater treatment plant. Maybe your homework is there. Then we're going there, too. Ah! Oils, mostly from car and truck engines. Sand and grit, from construction or sand used on icy roads in winter. And solids. That means pretty much anything else that ends up in the water. Old shoes, spare parts. Boats? Boats. They'd all be right here. <laughs> Your boat's not here. It's raining. Oh, but the sanitation workers said everything that goes down the drain goes here. <laughs> it does, except during heavy rains. The system can't handle all the storm water and it overflows. <sighs> right now, the pipes and tanks are backed up. So anything on its way here isn't going to get here. <laughs> there, it goes down the river to the ocean. <gasps> At least I think that's my boat. Oh, and ancient Egyptians used them and stuff. So when it rains, everything goes into the ocean? Ah. That's awful. Somebody ought to figure out a way to warn people. Yeah, they should paint a model boat with an X through it on the street drains so some other kid doesn't lose his history homework like I did. And while they're at it, they should paint, like, birds and fish and, and little wavy things for water on the street drains. And then, like, paint a coffee cup with an X through it so people know not to litter because it'll end up in the ocean. That's a very good idea, Steve. It is? Um, I mean, yeah, it is. Uh... Does this mean I get extra credit? <laughs> Perhaps. This was a terrific idea for a class project, Steve. Ah, thanks. Of course, the bad news is you won't get to be in history class with Betsy next year. <gasps> All right! Yeah! Steve's grade was looking better. <laughs> and so was the water. Because when it comes to litter, monkeys don't monkey around. <laughs>